Papa, how do you know if you're in love? Why, Finn? Do you think you are in love? I don't know. Love should feel good. You and Mama are the only ones I love. But this hurts. Sometimes I can't even think straight. <laughs> that sounds like love. It could be. I was once like that. I'm very sorry, son. Scorpion goddess Circe. She protected Iset and Horus from jealous Set. She still protects against poisonous animals, but not love. And against that, there is no protection. Not even the gods can. The car is gone. Those you Egyptians are coming to tempt you. Where are my Seni and Senu? So sad to see the Serapians so quiet. Great Serapis. Are you as merciful as Amun? Welcome, brother. Thank you, priest. It is good to see Egyptians come back. Since my drummer was jailed, it has been quiet. The silence is striking. A tanner jailed my drummer, accused him of stealing a precious Nubian lion skin from the Daivats. Poor soul even worked for him. Tragic. He is an honest man. Leave this in my hands, priest. Magi, my drummer, is in the Kibotos arsenal nearest the library. Serapis, walk with you. And you, priest. Hey, wait! Worms can have you!
You! Yeah, big guy. You have got the look of a man who can have things. Uh, namely, me and my injured foot. I come on the priest's request, drummer. Then get me out of here, Magi! I cannot help but think. You seem cheerful for a man unable to walk. You jest, Charlie. This is the best day of my life. My foot will cost that Tanner. Hey, what? Surely you're I'm going to gut you. What is it you think I can do? Find the fools who stole it, of course. Return that skin and clear my name. Who stole the lion skin? I turned away from the lion skin for a moment, and a bandit nabbed it and ran away. I lost him in the crowd. It happened in the Egyptian district. The guards, of course, blame me. Tough life being an Egyptian in Alexandria. I will find them then. Go on, get that skin. I will be fine. Just need to rest my leg. Then I will go and meet the priest. You clear my name. Tana lied about that skin. It's almost worthless. You know the Greeks. Easy enough work stealing from him. Skins for days. This is better than fishing. I've yet to get the smell of crocodile out of my nose. Wonder what skin that Tanner will destroy next. He's old. His face is leather already. Would only improve it. <laughs> Clear! Hey, do not expose yourself, honey! Hey! What's the meaning of you? You are dead! Oh. Wait a second. <laughs> Color for a lion. This man is a thief! Peace, Theon. He claims to not have stolen a thing. Do you wish Serapis displeased with you? No. I am going to sue you for my broken leg, you naked idiot! That is not helping. I knew you Egyptians were all alike. This is what I get for hiring you. Thieves all! I have my best man on this. We will fix it. I am the wronged party here. My skin was stolen. And if you want it back, you will pay him for his suffering. And make amends by kneeling to Serapis. This is your answer, priest? Extortion? Fine. I feel Serapis and I have a long road ahead of us. Blessings on your journey, brother. <laughs> I wish to serve Serapis further, if you have need. There is one thing. There has been food taken by the guards malignly in the name of Serapis. They take a tithe, then take double for themselves. They bring it to their arsenal and share it with their Philakitai. The people now starve. I worry it will get worse. Do not worry, priest. I will see the people fed. I will await among the people at the docks. I shall not be seen in this area. Your. <laughs> One cart of food, priest, as asked for. The Pharaoh's guards were happy to donate it. This Seni is more than I expected. The people will be served by Serapis today. May you walk lightly in his steps, priest. 
and you, Magi. Where's that bottle of wine? Who are you? One of Eudorus Philakis? I am no friend of Eudorus. He brought nothing but sorrow to my husband Aristo. The great poet philosopher, jailed. Jailed for writing beautiful things. Words are a powerful weapon. My love spent years writing his masterwork. Years. Then Eudorus plagiarized it and passed my husband's genius off as his own. And Aristo took him to court. Months of arguments. In the end, my husband is beaten, ridiculed, and tossed in a cage. Is this what passes for justice in Alexandria? Oh, my dear man. If you write this wrong, my husband and I can flee this city and be done with this ordeal. If you free him, I know of a boat that will take him on the southern docks. I will wait for you. Please. Just bring me back my Aristo. Will no one help me? You cowards! Who's this? Another of you Doros sycophants come to sneer? Leave me alone with my woes. I am a friend of Phanos, a protector. Keep that one next. That one smells vile. Look out. Be wary. He's care. He has bugs. Bugs! Get out of this city. You have more courage than Achilles himself. You've released me from daily beatings. We should go quickly. The Vlachos broke my hip. Be careful, I pray you. Your wife tells me to get you out of Alexandria. My wife, the dear woman, yes. There's a boat in port. Take me there. That Eudorus, what a detestable man. He couldn't forgive me for writing a better book. It was a book about denial, full of marvelous descriptions. I'm very good at descriptions, if I do say. That's why Eudorus stole so much of my book. His own writing is insipid. He knows nothing of the Nile River. Couldn't describe a hippopotamus if it beat him on the ass. The soldiers will certainly kill me if they find us. And what will become of my dear wife? She is the light of my life. She hated my book, though. Too many crocodiles, she says, which is a fair criticism. Still, Eudorus has a lot to answer for. We shall. We shall. Uh, I cannot believe they beat an old man. This new generation of Alexandrian poets seems to be of a new order. They certainly take risks. Give them my regards, will you? It is ever harder to produce good works here. Aristo! Over here! The boat is ready! We set sail as soon as you are aboard! My wife! Thank the beneficent gods! We made it! My love! I'm so grateful that you're free! We must flee. Those damned guards will find me. Egypt is no place for a philosopher. You should leave. The Philakitai will surely come after you. I shall flee. My wife has booked us passage to Crete. It was always our plan to go there. Perhaps we will have a better life there. May the gods look over you on your journey. My beliefs on duty and honor are ambivalent. 
but I can see that you have done yours. If all of Egypt was filled with men of your virtue, life would be divine. Not you. You will not do either. You, that insignia. You are a man of honor. There are so few remaining. I am a Magi. I solve problems. Good. I have one. A most precious treasure which must be delivered today. You will be well compensated for your work. Here are some drachmas to start. This city is much more expensive than I'm used to. Good. It is settled. Follow me. The thing I ask you to do is of the utmost importance. Of course it is. Being a merchant is no simple matter, sir. I assure you, moving tiger skins or even statues is not easy work. <laughs> ah, these workers never when you tell them to be. As I was saying, you must be quick. Oh, and do not stray from your task at all. I will know if you have. This is all I have left since the flood. Seems you care a lot for your... cargo. I swear on her mother's grave she was sent from the gods to make Alexandria better. She? I have your bodyguard, Kara. Do not let this be a repeat of the last time, daughter. Wait, no, this hardly seems to be what you asked. Medjai, I will put drachmas down your throat as long as she is safe. And Kara? Remember the reception tonight. You will be ready. Of course, father. I would not miss it. I am so happy you have come to assist me, sir. We will get you home fast. Do not worry. Oh, of course. Thank you, my bull. You look just like Heracles. Perhaps I'll call you my Heracles. Who? Ah, no matter. Child, it's time to return you home. I will not go. Have you met the priests here? Dull. No, I must go to the central market. I heard of new Persian linens. I need them. Or what? I will scream, which will call the soldiers. Then, well, even if you survive, father will be quite angry. Anubis, take this city. Are you Sekhmet in disguise, sent to test me? What was that? Nothing. Good. First, we must get my horse. She's been treated absolutely terribly without me around. You'd think someone would clean this water. Ugh. You guide the boats well. Much better than any of my other bodyguards. No, oh, if you want to go fast, it would be all right. Look at the city, Medjai. It must be so intimidating for someone like you. This part of the city, so rustic. You can smell it in the air. They live a truly simple life here. Five position, get it. Pegasus simply. <laughs> Young Miss, it's so nice to see you again. As you asked, she has been given new shoes. There now, was that so difficult? Now, out of my pay. The deal was only to get you home, not to pay for your horse. 
I'm sure my father would not be pleased with you discussing this in front of him, horseman. Of course. Uh, I'll discuss it with your father. Oh, Pegasus. I know you missed me. Yes, you did, you beautiful creature. If only you had wings. Time to go, bodyguard. That is it. I am taking you home, Princess Kara. Oh, all you big broody types are the same. Never let me have any fun. I should just leave you here. You're duty bound to deliver me, are you not? Who would know if I left? Your conscience would, of course. Look there, bodyguard. Th that is where I had my first discussion with a soldier. I am sure he was very grateful. We must stop at the market for more linens. I will take you to your house as your father bade, and nowhere else. Now lead on. You know, you are absolutely destroying my chances at getting the perfect linens. There are different kinds of linen? You are much more serious than my usual bodyguards. You could move faster, bodyguard. I have a name! Bayek. Ah, you do know my name. I remember all their names, you know. Whose names? The bodyguards. I send gifts to their families when I come. Gara. Gara. Yes? If we go find your linens, would you be happy? Really? Of course! Thank you, Bayek. You have an interesting stare. Thank you. We are close. Finally. Oh. Avrion. Aha! Finally! These linens show some promise. Ah, oh, it's so heavy. Would you help me? Bayek! Pegasus! They stole my horse! Stay here. Do not leave!
Give me time to... It is done. Time to get you home. Your troublesome mistress will have missed you. Pegasus, huh? I like it. It suits a horse. I would like your spirit. Hey, Papa, since Pegasus was limping, Bayek went to deal with her shoe. He was only gone a moment. Ah. I heard some commotion, but according to my little princess, you're the hero of the day. Can he always be my bodyguard? Please, Father? How much does it cost to hire a Medjai permanently? I am here only a short while. Alas. Then allow me to grant you a hero's pay for a hero's service. Lexi di Bulliman, a quiz. Bayek, you've returned to me. Are you ready to be my personal Magi? Uh, well, uh, no. I, I continue. Y you see. <laughs> you are so gullible, Bayek. I'm only happy to see you still in one piece. Best bodyguard in this city. Serapis, the snake will get his answer. I guess the works of Archimedes, Plato, Sappho, and Aristotle won't have your scribblings to keep them company. Those are all in there? They are. I guess you can copy this then. Too late, don't want it. Go ahead, take it. No, you can have it. Oh. How will I find Aya among all these endless scrolls? I find that Thanos talks too much. He has some interesting ideas. Very radical. It's almost alarming. You're right about that. But can't he express them concisely? You don't say. 
The knowledge of the entire world is at your fingertips. Here, one can reflect upon the oppressive regime under which we find ourselves laboring. The Alexandrian poets, have I mentioned them? are a group of dramatic artists dedicated to promoting free thinking throughout the land, no matter what the Pharaoh says. Despite the fact that the ruling Pharaoh is given to arbitrary and despotic decrees, here at the library we support free study, any topic you like. All right. Set up this. Now what? Ah, where is Aya? Ah, Serapis. I wrote a tragic comic pastoral epic centered on him. Ah. You're by, I guess. I am eager to see you. What she said. Quickly, follow me. I am sorry, my good fellow. You appear to be drunk. This library is for serious scholars only. She is in hiding. Who are you? Ah, interested in Homeric verse, eh? This way, please. I am Aya's cousin, Phanos. Ah, yes, Phanos. Nice to meet you in person. Tell me what is happening with Aya. Why are you being so discreet? Gennadio sent his men on a house-to-house -house search. Often they drag people into the street and torture them for information. Typical of the system we live under. Gennadios. A monster. The Philakitai of Alexandria. He is ravaging the city to find her. And where is she now? I have a very powerful friend. Apollodorus. No doubt you have heard of him. I have not. You will. In any case, he made a hiding place available to Aya after she ran into trouble. But what happened? You do not answer me. It is a mess of political intrigue. She will explain all, fear not. Clear off! What do you think you're doing? Son of a... What are you doing? Look! There's Thanos! He thinks he's a poet! The modern Sophocles. This is as far as I go. The way to Aya is found in the monument ahead. <laughs> Never again should we spend months apart. We only have each other. Without him, what? Let us be together. Us two. Each to each. I have news. You are scarred by justice. Ah. I bludgeoned Medunamun with this. I hate that we have to do these things. But I am grateful that you did. If I am honest, I took pleasure in it. Mm. I've missed your touch. I have missed touching you. <laughs> I killed as well. Acteon. I hunted him down and discovered a mask in his room. 
When he returned, I forced him to wear it. Then I thrust this knife through his eye slits. Aya. But I was careless. Another of the masked ones tracked me to my home. It was even more difficult. We have one more. Then, we will be done. <laughs> Look at this. I took it from Acteon. Apollodorus tells me it is a papyrus from the Royal Council, which means the snake is in Ptolemy's court. How does this Apollodorus know these things? He has informants everywhere, because of his work with Cleopatra. But Cleopatra? She's been declared a criminal. <laughs> By her treacherous brother, yes. She plans to take back the throne. She wants the snake dead as much as we do. And she trusts me. She gave me this to slit his throat. It's an ancient blade that killed the tyrant Xerxes. A weapon of justice. <laughs> Ingenious. Ah. I will go to the palace and discover who uses the seal of the snake. And I will use this. You'll find plenty of information in the royal scribe's office. He spends his time at the bathhouse. Go search the palace while he's away. And you? I cannot leave here as long as Gennadios walks the streets. He is determined to kill me. In addition to the snake, I will see what I can learn of this Gennadios and silence him. Discover who the snake is and show him the face of death. I'll meet you at the Paneum when you have killed both the snake and Gennadios. My heart aches until I see you again. As does mine, my love. Who is the snake? I have yet to discover that. The clue must be there in the palace. Search for the seal found upon the letter. It's too dangerous to leave this den as long as Gennadios and his men are searching for me. The seal will certainly be found within the palace. I cannot leave this den as long as Gennadios lives. What's this? That leads to the docks. I can't believe Thanos had you go through the pit. should be cautious around here. Stay there! <laughs> Find this woman! She has murdered a friend of the royal court. At your command, Philakatai. Why have you dragged me into the land of the dead? You sought to kill my wife! Your whore of a wife is a murderess. Wafely and wantonly. 
I did my duty as a Philagetai, and for this you have taken my life. Is your vengeance above all law, Medjai? Be warned. The Philakes will hunt you down and exact revenge. May the Hidden One walk beside you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. Important. Locked. These are the rooms of the royal scribe. The ladder. Hmm. Papers. This just belongs to the royal scribe himself, Eudorus. Huh? False bottom. A letter. Esteemed Ibis, the Pharaoh remains compliant and is our puppet in all things. Act with caution in Siwa. The murder of the Heron was but the first. Two from among us here in Alexandria have also been killed. However, the situation is under control. Canadius is actively questioning the populace. We commend your efforts, Ibis. Long life. Stamp to the seal of the snake. The snake is Eudorus. The royal scribe. I have said that the royal scribe is often at the bathhouse. I will kill that naked ear that you dot us there. Aristo is taking Eudorus to court for plagiarism. No. I was visiting the docks and heard it from Aristo's wife herself. His wife? She works herself into histrionics over nothing. Eudorus stole whole paragraphs from Aristo's book about the Nile. Chooses his horses the badly. building alone is worth it. Have thing. you seen his wife? Look up at that expansive ceiling. Simply divine. Oh, 
Awaiting is everything to your liking, my lord? The water is a bit terrible to me. Such a comment. Halt! My lord, are you properly served? Follow me is a chinless symbol. Simonides, See that my towels are ready. have consumed too much wine. I have, and I will again. But had I not, would a pharaoh be any less a goose? I should be cautious around here. Can I do anything for you, my lord? Stop annoying me, if you please. Idiot. you to kill me. It was you who murdered my son before my eyes. You are a fool. At the temple, in Siwa! That forsaken shithole? I had nothing to do with that disaster. It is too late for your lies. Anubis awaits. It is worth the loss to slay the snake at last. The snake? The snake will never die. Go. Son of Apep, the Lord of the Duat awaits. Eudoros! Killed! Oh, dear gods! He's been murdered! Look at the blood! But he was so handsome! It's Eudoros, poor soul! My dearest. The snake and Gennadios are dead. Oh. It was Eudorus. He died flailing in the baths. I wish I had been there. My wife. My wife. 